today's virtualized IT environments, IT managers face numerous challenges. Despite the progress that is made in infrastructure robustness, downtime incidents that last from just a few minutes to several days are still a valid and terrifying threat to the industry that completely incapriciate the business, causing tremendous losses. Time is the most precious IT resource, and IT downtime costs businesses millions of dollars annually. Businesses not only lose money during periods of downtime, but also hours of productivity, affecting the quality and performance as well. Our admins have to perform long, manually intensive, error-prone recovery processes that hinder service restoration efforts, impairing user productivity, customer satisfaction and revenue. The challenges are added to go with solutions that are really difficult to configure and automate while labeling to ensure compliance. Many organizations are held by inefficient legacy data replication and DR products that squander bandwidth in storage capacity. Ultimately, they are concerned about how to add value to the business and improve the line of business services by mitigating these risks. HP SimpliVity Rapid DR is the solution to effectively combat all the issues that are faced by the customer. Based on the inherent data efficiency of HP SimpliVity's hyperconverged infrastructure, it simplifies the DR setup and execution by streamlining setup and avoiding complicated scripting exercises that consume time, resources, and budget. SimpliVity Rapid DR improves compliance and risk mitigation, enabling strict compliance with stringent DR and business continuity regulations. It is a cost-effective DR solution. Now avoid the added expense and complexity of the special-purpose DR automation tools and standalone replication products. All in all, Rapid DR provides rapid recovery through automation and it greatly reduces service disruptions by automating recovery site and eliminating proctored manual recovery processes. Built using the HP SimpliVity's REST APIs, RapidDR is a DR automation utility with two key components. The RapidDR tool is a lightweight Windows executable and the recovery configuration file is a simple XML file with all the disaster recovery configuration details including the failover and the failback workflows. The solution further extends the inherent data efficiencies of HP SimpliVity's hyperconverged infrastructure solution slashing recovery point objectives and recovery time objectives from days to hours to minutes. HP SimpliVity Rapid DR execution consists of the following. The Rapid DR plan wherein you can create or modify a DR recovery workflow, save the same recovery configuration file. Rapid DR failover, execute or test a recovery plan with the pre-configured recovery workflow. DR failback, execute or test a failback plan with the pre-configured recovery workflow using the same plan. This demo environment is two sites. Forteresa is the primary or main site with two nodes in the cluster providing a highly available environment. In the event of a failure, you would want to recover back your VMs on the recovery site, which in this case is Recife. Provided we have a valid recovery plan, we can perform the failover execute. Select a recovery plan that is created by you. Enter the passcode details. Once the passcode validation succeeds, click on next. For recovery options, I choose the option use source site network settings and as for the error action, I choose retry once and skip. If a virtual machine recovery fails, RapidDR tries to recover the virtual machines one more time before proceeding with recovery of the other virtual machines in the recovery plan. As for the retry once and abort, if the virtual machine recovery fails, RapidDR tries to recover the virtual machine one more time and if the virtual machine recovery fails, it aborts the entire recovery operation. For skip and proceed, if a virtual machine recovery fails, RapidDR proceeds with the recovery of the other virtual machines. And as for abort recovery, RapidDR aborts the entire recovery operation if there is any failure. But for the purpose of this demo, I'm going to use the option retry once and skip. RapidDR also lets you specify an RPO based on your business needs. For the purpose of this demo, I'm going to use the option Recover from the latest backup and click on Next. 
proceed with validation or skip it entirely. Validating the recovery plan setting against resources or network anomalies on the recovery site avoids automated recovery failures. You also have the option to generate the report of the validation using the audit report. Proceed with the shutdown of the VMs. The recovery will start in the DR site by finding and restoring the VMs from the latest backup provided. Next, you can review the execution summary. It gives you all the overall recovery time. We can see that the VMs have been recovered. Save this report. You also have the option to export the recovery summary in the PDF format which has the step-by-step -step recovery summary for audit or compliance purposes. Click on Finish. Validate the recovery process from the vCenter. Here we see that the VMs have failed over to the recovery site, which in this case is recipe. Stay tuned for next video that is part 2. For more information, please visit www.hpa.com.